I've got a mess of stuff behind me. We're taking a lot to the auction. We're filling up the booth with some of this stuff and a lot of it's going on eBay and Etsy. But right now we're gonna organize and try to figure out what's gonna go to the auction. <music> Yeah, so got lots of stuff here. Um, these records, probably 60% are good. The other ones are not good. They're going to be the ones that don't sell. But I uh, just got to go through them. Um, just bought bunches. But as you can see, lots and lots of stuff here. Lots of stuff that could be sold on eBay and do very well. Those two together are about $300. But I just haven't had time to, to go through it. Um, so now we're going to go through it. And uh, what we don't get to auction this time around, we'll take to auction next time around. Now the downstairs has been taken care of pretty well where it's organized. But there's still lots of stuff. Like this stuff all in this garage is probably, let's say, 40% of what I have. All right, guys, so I'm headed to an auction right now. I'm gonna go uh, bring some stuff there instead of buying stuff. Some things I might do very, very well in. I might even do better than if I was to put it in the booth or sell it on eBay. All right, so let's take a quick look at some of the stuff I'm bringing in here. Uh, in there, I have six different groups of paper comics. Here is some sheet music. Now, these are kind of things that I don't know if I can sell online, sell in the booth. They're going to take a, they're a bit of a hassle. So I'm just going to try to dump them, unload them here. I really can't have nothing in it. A couple blow molds. These lamps here. Now, they do very well if they're complete, working, rewired, that kind of thing. They were a work in progress. I just don't have time. So we'll see what how they do in the auctions. I, I told them sell them together or individually it's up to you however you want to list them uh, a couple lobby cards there for uh, some movies in the 70s you would have saw some lighting those are new and uh, behind there just behind the bin there um those those were new and they're from an auction uh from the storage locker that i've already made my money back on so with all the jewelry there's a bunch of jerseys in there they did not do very well at all they didn't in the booth so i'm going to auction them off get out get rid of them and move on uh some hockey cards baseball cards that kind of thing in there some more of those comics um we'll see how they do i don't know i've already made my money back paid 60 bucks for all those paper comics and uh well into the profits as well so i just want to get rid of them right now some cars there you would have saw from the uh storage locker i did earlier here's some old calendars uh the top one might do better than the other two just because it's uh old and it's local the other ones are local as well but they're not very good um just different things a variety of things some uh china some fritz and floyd stuff some uh vhs tapes uh all sorts of different stuff that's just been laying around if it doesn't sell here guys it's going to go right to goodwill in this for the most part for the most part of this kind of stuff um and i they said uh keep bringing as much as you want they have lots of room and uh, whatever doesn't go in this auction will go in other auctions all right, guys, so here is Dream Auctions. Uh, this is the webpage. I'm going to leave a link below so you can click onto it here, but I just want to give you an idea of what it looks like so you know that you're in the right sp space. Multi consigner auction, that's one that's already taken place, so that's over with. I am bringing my stuff to the April general auction. Uh, the auction starts April 2nd. You can see all that kind of stuff there. So, again, click the link below and you can go to it. I'm going to show you a little bit more here going forward. I'm just going to tell you that I'm really looking forward to seeing how this works. It's a good way to unload stuff. As you can see in my video here, I have lots of stuff at home. And uh, I just want to take it, get rid of it so I can keep moving forward. A lot of the stuff I do not have anything invested in simply because I bought a lot of stuff in bulk and this is stuff that's left over. I've already made my profit. So it's not really overly risky uh, as, uh, you know, per se. But uh, at the same time, it's going to be a great experience and hopefully um, make some money at the same time. I hate leaving stuff sitting in a garage or the basement when really it's just money sitting there. Now there's a little bit more of a close-up. April general auction. You can see the Royal Daltons uh, there in the in the little icon. You just when when you go to see that, you're just going to click on that, and it's going to take you further into the uh, into the auction that I'm going to be on uh, or have my stuff at again April second. 
Uh, so again, when you click on that, it's going to bring you to something like this, and you're just going to scroll down from here. Um, just going to talk about this page a little bit. They are currently loading more for this auction, so they'll be loading this right up till Friday. So uh, more stuff will be added. Um, I mean, it, it's self-explanatory. Mine will. She said she's going to start loading my stuff in there on Monday. So as you scroll down, you're going to see more of this kind of stuff, and there'll be multiple pages. Right now, I think there's two pages, um, and I've got it set up for 50 items per page, and there's another page. So anyways, guys, that's pretty much it. There'll be multiple pages. I don't know, 5, 6, 10. I'm not 100% sure. If you set it up for 50 items per page, I'm going to assume that there's probably about 6 to 10 pages. Uh, full of stuff. Um, I'm really looking forward to it, and uh, I just, you know, it, it's just going to be exciting. You're going to go pick up. A, I'm going to go pick up a check for stuff that's been sitting in the garage for a long period of time. So that's the stuff right there um, that's going to the auction. So you're going to see how well it does. I, I'm I'm really excited. I'm looking forward to this because it's going to be a great way to clear out old inventory and uh, stuff that sometimes you just get bombarded with. So. Anyways, next episode, you're going to see some of this. So I went to a estate sale and I got that. I got some of this kind of stuff here. And uh, this here. There's a sneak sneak peek and I got tons of, tons of stuff. Filled the entire truck up. It was a great sale. Um, might have overpaid, <laughs> might have overpaid for some of the stuff here. Um, and, and, and maybe not. Like, I mean, there's, there's, there's profit there. But you're going to see on the next episode what I got. Anyways, that's going to do it. Hit the subscriber button. Until next time, keep on picking.